Hello everyone, Jeff here, and welcome back to Brotato. It's actually been three days since I've played, which is the longest I've gone playing Brotato in an entire year, which is kind of crazy to think about. Um, anyway, uh, today we're going to mess with the GMO and Mash Tato mod back, pick up where we left off. Uh, unfortunately, when I switched back to all of my like uh, mods on after turning them off for the 182% run, uh, it looks like I haven't cleared it with anything, which is kind of sad, but whatever. Anyways, we're going to do Gardener plus Farmer. Um, pretty obvious combos there. I do want to use uh, the hoe for obvious reasons. However, I think we're supposed to start with pruner and then merge over to the hose later. Um, if uh, you haven't seen these characters before, the gardener starts with the garden, obviously. The shop always sells a garden, which is mostly a fantastic thing, but at the beginning it's not so great. One, because it takes up a shop slot, which is a cost. And two, because gardens cost double. So we have to get up our income before we can afford them. Also, consumables uh, recover uh, two less HP. So we need to pick up some consumable healing. And then engineering mods are down. That doesn't matter in the slightest. And then obviously farmer from the base game, 20 harvesting, increased harvesting mods in the wave. And more importantly, one harvesting when you pick up consumable max health. So we are going to do the farmer thing that is similar that we've done with farmer farmer before. Only this time, um, we're going to have infinite gardens? Question mark? That's the plan anyway. Let's see how it goes. Uh, so we don't want to get hit because that will actually take away. $87 on the first wave is outrageous. Uh, take harvesting over everything. This would take melee damage rather than the roll. See, it'd be cool to buy a garden, but when 12 is a lot. Um... Oh, we don't need to lock garden. I forget because it will always show up. So if we lock a garden, we'll see two gardens, which is like good info. But oh, we could take a penny here, but we still can't actually like roll into anything. I guess we'll roll to see if we. Oh, we got eliminate. I was going to say, see if we can roll into another pruner, but I think having four pruners to start wave two is fine like obviously we probably could have ended up with six there if we were to like if we like re-rolled and got tried to get the optimal shot but i don't think it really matters i think this should be an unseen un blah, words jeez uh this should be an obscenely easy run if everything pans out correctly uh take melee damage we could actually take a garden now but I don't think we're supposed to do that yet. I think we're supposed to get pruners. Um, I mean, we actually need the pruners to drop. A cute monkey is actually not terrible either. But we can do better. Uh, lumberjack shirt is nice. All right, there's another pruner. And now we can just save. We have 162 harvesting going into wave three. So that's like pretty decent. And then, and then we want luck because the goal here is going to be find a improved tools. I guess that means we want attack speed too, huh? Find an improved tools so we can up the gardens uh, spawn rate. And then at some point we switch over to hose and we, um, you know, do that. Um, take movement speed, take HP, take damage. I mean, I'm gonna take speed first. I take lifesteal. It's just a good, I mean, if you're offering me those upgrades. All right, I'll take the garden. Now that we have full pruners, I don't see a reason not to. I mean, obviously upgrading a pruner is still slightly better, but. Look at all that harvesting. Yeah, this is going to get real dumb real quick. And then, yeah, every garden is something. Hmm. Hmm. So if we were to pick up, let's say four of the spicy sauce, right? And then a bunch of explosion range. Is that like a 
Is that a ridiculous thought? Okay, we're just gonna take these good upgrades. I'm gonna buy a garden. Uh, we can't even buy a second garden, which is kind of crazy, but it's all right. There's a hoe. I don't think we're there yet. Again, this sitting here is a cost. Makes this a lot more difficult. Um, I, You know what? It's fine. We're fine. It's a, it's a lot. Yeah, so if we get a bunch of spicy sauce and like explosion range up, we could have this insane all garden build where basically all of our gardens or all of our fruits become just massive explosions. And the reason I'm talking about this is normally you can't do something like that. Um, just normally because, you know, the shop really won't allow it. But we're going to have so much money that we should be able to buy basically whatever we want. We're going to have like Batman levels of money here. I'm oh, sorry, Bruce Wayne levels of money. Batman is just a guy in a suit. Uh, $406 on wave five is kind of decent. This is all unexciting. Okay. Um, we will take a lucky charm and a garden. And coffee, because like I said before, we definitely want attack speed. For when we inevitably find stat ups is magical hat worth it probably let's see what we get we got rum duct tape well oh we got work overtime oh that was insane okay yeah that was worth it <laughs> i mean 20 harvesting isn't gonna be that much by the end of it but it's not an irrelevant number now the question is are we gonna be able to get our harvesting as high as we normally could with like double farmer probably not uh, because getting two, uh, getting two harvesting per garden is kind of ridiculous, but maybe with the amount of gardens we're going to have. I do have to, like, make sure to not take damage. I guess we have some, like, decent stats, too. Man, the game is so much easier when the enemies aren't 50% faster. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. Um, I'm gonna take percent damage and some life steal. We're gonna buy a garden, of course. And then we're gonna buy another garden because we can afford it. And then a lost duck and pruner. Roll one more time. I will take a peasant garb. So probably need to make sure that we are sufficiently equipped for the next wave, uh, survivability wise, as we basically focused on, uh, you know, nothing except for harvesting at the uh, up to this point. Um, I guess we do have a roundabout way of a bunch of survivability, but it would be really nice to pick up like some lemonade or some weird food or something like that so that our consumed healing goes from uh, one to I don't know, three or four or something like that. And we don't actually have to beat any enemies. We could just like run away like what we're doing. It's pretty good. Uh, Peaceful Bunny's good. You take range to get melee damage. I think range It's decent. Armor, I'm going to take 10 luck because there's a, there's some things we could do. I guess we take acid here. Probably Cyclops Worm. Gives us a free reroll. Okay. I don't feel so bad about that. Um, It wasn't like an exciting wave or anything, but I think that makes us a bit stronger. Again, not lemonade, not weird food, which is, again, kind of bad. I guess we really want a bunch of dangerous bunnies, right? Uh, anything that gives us more rerolls. I mean, we also have diversified installed, so... You know, robbery membership card is an item. That's two rerolls, so, like... We could... We could end up in a spot where we have enough rerolls that the... 
always having a garden isn't the end of the world. It's funny how, like, it's insanely good, but also... Not a... Not a hundred percent positive. That's a lot of harvesting, though. Oh, a crown? Okay, well. That's fine. And attack speed. And two armor. Those are good. A lemon tree. Um... Yes. And a garden. Can't buy another garden. That's okay. We're going into wave nine, so... We can kind of do what we want here. I will revamp something. Sure. Take the tentacle. Tentacle will be good later. That's my thought. I guess... I think... Yeah, we're at the point now. I don't know. I guess I think the, the, you should never say those two words like in a row. It makes I, I feel like I just sounded so ridiculous just then. Anyway, I think we're at the point where we start taking hose um, for, um, you know, scaling based off of our harvesting. Because our harvesting is pretty outrageous at this point. Uh, and it's going to start going up by a lot the <laughs> getting the crown on going into nine was kind of a nice pickup honestly the only thing i think that can really help us from this point that like that really breaks the run open is an improved tools which um i don't know that we're tagged for that or anything but we'll see i will take a peacock take some dodge it's fine uh let's take speed for defense Let's purchase a pruner, get a garden. Let's take wheat. Let's get a garden. Uh, let's take bullet time over a garden because enemy speed down is huge. Rituals kind of whatever. Still negative one consumable heal, which isn't great. Um, we do have almost a thousand harvesting already, though. And it's going to go up. I have found that having a one less slot, one less shop slot. Um, and any character that's had it is actually like a big deal when it comes to looking for the items like it, you don't think about it too much but that slot is literally 25 percent chance of you finding something you want every time you roll um it ends up being a big deal um just gonna try and not get hit so we get all the food yeah there there we go 1100 now torn pocket we could do some stuff with that i think we actually take luck here first and then we take armor and attack speed okay these are all good things crit chance sure we obviously purchase that um this this i'm actually not gonna buy a garden here because we have an elite coming and we're pretty weak Okay, never mind. I'm going to buy this robbery and then I'm going to purchase this garden. Uh, <laughs> never mind everything I said. Ooh, alien eyes. Okay. I will take death protection. So we're not strong right now. Just for the record, we are not. This is not. This is the like the last guy I wanted to fight. Um. Because I feel like we're going to have to fight him for basically the whole wave. Because we just don't do any damage. Like, we, it's unfortunate, but that's kind of what we're at right now. It was intended. It's just that we haven't seen any hoes, uh, which is ridiculous. Should be hoes everywhere. But... Actually, maybe we are going to get him. Or maybe we're going to die. I don't know. It's a possibility. I did take death protection though, so...
until we can get with the hose, we have to use protection. There's a lot, you know, that doesn't even make sense. Um, could you just stop? Okay, full heal. Let's run away, break this. Sure, whatever. We survive, that's all that matters. Uh, Fortress is insane. Explosive turret is unironically great here. Because it helps us with the things that we're suffering from right now. Take percent damage. We're going to steal a garden. We're going to steal a garden basically every every shop. Garden. There's a spicy sauce. Okay. Okay. It's not nothing. Garden. Recycling machine. Pruner. We could white flag. Just don't see it. Oh, magic mirror. What are we magic mirroring, though? Uh, let's take some ginger tea and then we'll. We'll figure out magic mirror for next wave. So explosive turret, huh? So. Even with no engineering or specifically with no negative engineering. Having an AOE 25 damage, just spamming attacks in the mid teens waves is actually pretty effective. Like, obviously, if you're looking, it's not really going to do anything against the bigger aliens. It will it will weaken them, but more importantly, it helps from getting helps you from getting swarmed. And if you have an ugly tooth, then it just slows as well. Um, it's just really good. Like, basically anytime you don't have negative engineering, I would take explosive, uh, turret. From, like, when you're getting it for free. Um, do we take 12 harvesting here? Probably. I mean, that's what we're doing. Max speed, more luck. Do we magic mirror or garden? It seems like kind of loose. Let's just take a garden, magic mirror, and then see if we can find something more interesting. Um, you know, just anything, really. Heavy bullets, that's cute. Huh. Wheat. Triple wheat. Okay. My garden. Maelstrom. I love this. I love this item. Uh, we have no elemental damage, so it's kind of bad here, but it's fine. It's fine. Chopper? Chopper's not terrible. A tree. One harvesting until the end of a wave when you dodge an attack. That's not so great. Yeah. I know I wasted a lot of money rolling there, but I'm just we're digging for improved tools pretty hard right now. And again, hose or pitchforks, either one. But like picking up some hose would be just insane for us right now. It would basically solve all of our damage issues, which Look, if you want to run this build and win immediately, you just go all tank and you don't have to worry about anything at all. Don't even worry about damage stats, which is pretty easy to do, I would say. But I'm trying to get degenerate here. I guess we need max HP so that our um, spicy explosions do some actual damage instead of whatever is happening right now. We do only have 59 HP. Um, no, four elemental damage. Look, am I, I'm investing my in Maelstrom. Not a lot. Okay, 15 luck, 15 attack speed, steal a garden, we'll upgrade a pruner. Um, garden. I'll take a clover for the luck. We'll take another garden. 
Poopon into Garden. I'm gonna not take Gardens now. Take a Pruner. Lost Duck. Okay, I know... I know the hoes exist. Where they are? Who knows? Um... Let's just take another garden. It's fine. Whatever. All right. Wave 14 elite. I think we should be fine. I think we'll do enough damage now. Yeah, we do. Just from the amount of stats alone we have. Um, What I'm going to do is leave that full heal right there, though. So that if... We are low on health towards the end of the wave. I can pick it up. At which point we will get the full heal. We won't have to use any of the consumables heals. So we'll get max uh, harvesting gain at the end of the wave. It's, you know, is it super like important? Maybe. Is it the proper way to play? Yes. This wave is also just straight up terrifying. Um, we're gonna go walk over it right now. Yeah, that worked out. Spider. Yeah, spider's gonna be decent. Um, who got gains doesn't really matter. Really want like a max HP here. Okay. Attack speed, and then we can take armor. Yeah, we're supposed to take armor there. Let's steal a garden. Buy a garden. Buy a garden. Buy a black belt. Um, garden. Revamp. I'm gonna stop buying gardens now. There's a dangerous bunny. That's nice. Get this pruner. It would be really. It would be really like super neat to find a hoe or something like that. All right, there's another spider. I'm gonna take that. Now there's some incentive to just purchase another weapon. That's another spider. What's happening? Classic explosive. Okay, there's some serious incentive to have some other type of weapon now with all the spiders we just picked up. And let's be honest, we don't need all these pruners anymore. They're fun, but like... Um, how many gardens do we actually have? Like, how many gardens? We have 28 gardens right now. We could, I mean, we just picked up three spiders. We could drop, we could definitely drop our lowest pruner to start with. And honestly, we could go for any weapons at this point. We don't have to be going after the hose. We could be going after laser beams. Or, you know, whatever weapon I see that really, like, tickles my fancy, right? Although the hose would really tickle my fancy. But, you know, whatever. It's fine. 3,100 is not bad. I'll take 40% XP. Um... 4% lifesteal is fine. I'm going to take more attack speed with the prospect of, you know, that plastic explosive with the prospect that we're actually going to find actual stuff. Let's take domino. Let's take a black belt. I guess I'll upgrade pruner. Oh, we could piggy bank here. All right. Here's the thing. If we want to go endless with this build, which we could, um, I would take a piggy bank now, at which point we basically stop purchasing things and go kind of insane. Hmm. This is a tough decision. And not from like winning, but like what's better for content here? I think we take the piggy bank. And I'm going to roll one time. Okay. Um, yeah.
Yeah, we might take this into Endless. Just because. Like, this is real dumb. And I feel like we can generate some nonsense with all of the food on the ground. Plus, we have robbery. It's pretty good. We're gonna have a lot of... We That lemon cost us an HP. Unbelievable. Unbelievable lemon tree. How dare you betray me like that. Alright, we have 6,500. We will take cake. Cell missile. Let's roll for something better. All right, max HP is insane. Take some range. Take harvesting. Rit chance. Harvesting, since we're doing this. Um, do we magic mirror a garden? I... I think so. It's weird. Uh, okay, then we just pass and we have $7,500. We don't want to buy any structure that's not a garden so that, you know, we don't lose any actual garden. Because I think the limit's 100, if I recall correctly. I know it, like, used to be 100. I, sometimes these things change. I, I don't... I really should have looked before doing this build because I... I know that that was a possibility when we started. I could go search it up now, but I'm just going to assume that it's 100 and we'll go from there. So, yeah, we want a harvesting scaling weapon or something. I don't know. That's, uh, yeah, 12,000. Sounds about right. Take some lifesteal, take speed, sure. Max HP is pretty good here. Attack speed. Armor. Rubber bullets. No. Garden, no. I'm gonna roll a couple times here. Just trying to find improved tools. Because it is a big deal if we find it. Suspicious coupon, you say. Okay. Well, let's buy that after after this wave. We'll just buy another garden. No reason to suspicious coupon into the elite wave. That's relatively foolish. Although, let's be honest here. I think we're I think we're all right. Can I, I, okay, here's the question. Can I get to wave 40 in under an hour for the video? That's that's going to be my new goal here. Just for this run. I, I don't plan on doing a bunch of wave 40 videos, but uh, given what we're doing right now, it feels more appropriate to push the limits a little, let's say. I mean, at the, the piggy bank was really the deciding factor on all of that, too. Let's see. 20,000. Well, that's just insane. One crit chance for everyone melee. All right. Staying hydrated. Very important. Pig percent damage. We take HP regen. It's like fine, I guess. Take two armor, it's damage. All right. All right, we can... We're gonna take the suspicious coupon, right? Let's do this, then this, and let's roll. 
Well, I guess we're capped out. Um, Still no improved tools is crazy. All right, we'll buy a lemon tree. Uh, community support. It's fine. We'll just go to wave 19. Go 20,000 materials. You know, maybe we get to like, what, 30,000 by the end of this wave. Then Piggy Bank gives us, let's say another what? 6k or something it's 20% 20% of 30k is 6k so like eh, you know maybe puts us in a decent spot uh, suspicious coupon makes everything cheaper including the gardens I think at this point I just want to get 100 gardens and we'll like go from there I do wonder you know I have a feeling that the the lemon trees count as structures not trees. Also, I guess we do have the explosive turret, but whatever, that's fine. Not too concerned about it. All right, 30K, yeah, about what we expected. Then plus some rerolls here. Um, let's take some dodge. Harvesting melee damage, I guess. I don't know. Max HP is good, okay. We do have three spiders. Like that's a that's a real thing. Um, I'm gonna roll. Well, being able to steal a durian tree is kind of insane. It gives you luck, HP, or damage, and then take a poisonous tonic. There's a crutch. I don't know why we would ever use this. I'm sure. I'm sure there's a character that wants this for something, but like. The stats on this do not line up to being even close to a good weapon. Bookshot's cute. Um, we're really, again, only rolling here to see if we can get an improved tools. Uh, about one more. Get a dangerous bunny. Roll. No, okay. So we go to endless. We're gonna cash in on one more, one more uh, piggy bank usage, which is uh, pretty decent. Let's see if we can get some decent items out of these guys. We really need I don't know, stuff like anvil would be nice. Maybe. I mean, literally just improve tools is all we want but it's fine um besides anvil we get like a grinds leaf that would be decent that's super excited i guess we just get a hoodie right probably nothing better than a hoodie like normal but uh, is that being greedy? And then there's like other, there's probably other weapons that I don't even know about or other tier four items. I'm not even sure what they do. All right, with 42,000 materials, is pretty decent. The moon, I mean, yeah, it's fine. And the sun, oh, that's thematic. At the very least, take dodge. <laughs> we have the sun and the moon. All the same boss. That's kind of funny. All right. We are now no longer needing to save money, so we're able to spend a bit here. The garden goes in. A lucky coin is uh, good time. Garden. We do need to buy the gardens because they will. Uh, they will get more expensive. All right, anvil's insane. Pokeball. This. Oh, we could pitchfork. Um, we don't get the benefit. Let's just skip Pitchfork for now. I think we're past where we want it to be. All right, Garden. Garden. We're still going to keep taking Gardens, though. Although at some point, it won't be make sense because we're just taking Gardens to increase our harvesting. 
Um, but then our harvesting is going down because, you know, waves and whatnot. So maybe should, we should be spending our stuff elsewhere here. On all of this trash that we're seeing. Um, improved tools would be really sweet. All right, let's just let's just go with this for now. The sword is likely to get us some XP gain. I think we're, I think we're likely to find ourselves in a situation with three, three spiders that we're just using six different weapons. Um, it's probably fine as well. I mean, it's going to take a little bit for our harvesting to actually go down. So we should be able to... We should be able to get some decent stuff. I mean, improve... If we got improved tools, we might actually crash the game too, because we're going to be getting like... A fruit every second for every garden. Which is going to be... Um... Fairly outrageous. Losing 2,000 uh, harvesting feels kind of bad, for sure. I'll uh, take lifesteal, take max HP, take lifesteal again, take luck. We'll take dodge. I'm going to steal a garden. I'll buy a shady potion. We have 269 luck. Where are all of our like sick items? All right, there's alien eyes is good. Uh, banner, that's what we want. Sif's Relic is great. A uh, wrench, not really what we're after. Non gate, more enemies for attack speed. Yes. Yes. The leather vest is good defense. There's another ghost sword. I don't think we really care about that too much. All right, mouse is good. Take both of those. Baby Echo. We didn't need to buy Baby Echo because we already have the other thing. Um, our crit is already capped. Notably. Uh, I don't want to spend too much. Oh, Lemonade is nice. <laughs> Alright, that was like a pretty terrible shop, all things considered, but... I guess worse things have happened. We're still, like, incredibly strong. I think we can handle wave... I, I don't I mean, we can't handle wave 40 yet. We don't have the stuff required but we do have an anvil so we're getting armor every time we do have a fortress so we're getting damage for the anvil um we are getting some extra xp gain because of the sword not any sort of significant amount we're getting a lot of stats from these like fruit trees though And then harvesting with 52 material. Take peaceful bunny. Let's take a snail. No need to take that. Mammoth seems decent. Um, attack speed, obviously. And then armor. And speed. And then max HP. And then take damage. All right, we steal a garden. Roll, see if we can. All right, tentacles good. I'm going to buy another couple gardens here. Adrenaline. Drop consumable for every six shots. Okay. Sure. <laughs> sure. Um, it also, you know, helps out with the attack speed. Where is the improved tools? That's all I'm saying. Where's that? I know it exists. Um, 
shops are gonna get expensive here soon so that's why i'm like spending more money uh torture is not a good let's let's skip that uh fairy not so great okay 200 is too much to reroll all right so now we have a war club which is cute um for sure but also still not really insane i guess if it drops a food every six attacks and attacks fast enough that's pretty decent i thought there would be more enemies but there's they're just they don't do this i don't know what's happening Everything's just dead. Everything's dead forever. Um. Well. This is going pretty decently, I'd say. We just, we just have a lot of stats now. another 50k i will take a tree sure uh, none of these things matter uh 25 damage is decent take luck take speed take not engineering we don't get that armor power fist nah nah fortunately cacti club it's not it panda is decent We have no elemental damage, that's for sure. There's a hatchet. Attacks real fast. Our percent damage is just really low, is what I'm noticing. Alright, let's sell let's sell this for the hatchet for extra attack speed. We need more percent damage. I don't know where all of it has gone, but we should probably pick some up at some point here. 2% max HP for every permanent armor. Um, okay. <laughs> I guess that's fine. This, this, this. I'm just gonna buy the shop here. The reroll. Mouse. Garden. X marks the spot. No, keep buying gardens. How many gardens do we have? Like, we want to get to 100. That's where it's 80. Okay. 80 gardens. Two crocodiles. You went to the wrong Florida man's house, friend. Uh, I realized what's, um, why there's no enemies. We have alien eyes plus domino. And we have enough luck that it's going to defeat the enemies itself so yeah unfortunate i guess i don't know maybe maybe not breaking the game now all right give me this 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 yeah oh i should have taken the damage there that was a mistake we got to take percent damage where you can find yeah i take a diploma just for the xp gain up power generator is a big deal Ghost pruner? Okay. <laughs> Big arms. Sure. Sure, this is fine. That is an obliterator. 
We don't have much range damage, but like we could. Like we definitely could have a lot of range damage. So what if we just took it? It also attacks pretty fast with our attack speed. I don't know. We don't need pruners, right? So why not? Twenty-five wave twenty-five. All right, I'm. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna skip ahead to the next like elite wave or whatever. Um, because otherwise I think this video is gonna be like way over an hour. So I'm gonna do that, and I will see you all in a second. Okay, we're going into the elite wave now. Um, we're also probably gonna end this video at wave thirty, and I say that because we're coming very close to crashing the game at the end of every wave. Um. If you take a look, we now have 101 gardens, um, which is turning out to be quite the problem. I guess we'll take inspiration or something and lure is fine. We also magic mirrored ourselves some, uh, you know, a full set of hunting trophies, which is kind of cute. Uh, is it really necessary at this point? No, but I do love magic mirrors, so it was an excuse to use it. I also rolled past like two um, weird food, which was kind of dumb. Oh, we could just take bloody hand here. Um, and then tree and then I don't know. Um, it doesn't really matter. I don't think at this point what we do. Uh, Pocket factory crashes the game with all of the stuff we have going on. We gained 500 materials. More enemies, more mice. I mean, we still have so much money here to do kind of whatever we want with, but it's just there's not much to do. So let's just go to wave 28. You'll see at the end of the wave what's happening. This guy's going to just die. Um, yeah, we're we're obscenely strong at this point. We are dodge capped. We only have 21 armor, which isn't that much at this point. Uh, we also haven't found improved tools, and the problem I'm having right now, uh, thinking about this, is if we find improved tools, the game is going to crash on wave end, like, 100%. Because as soon as, as soon as the wave ends, like, I'm literally running around now to pick up as many fruits as possible, so they aren't triggered on, at the end of the wave because it does not handle all the calculations well. It's just too many triggers at once. Because um, obviously this isn't, you know... Even on Vanilla Endless, this isn't really intended. But um, here we go. Uh, okay, that wasn't too bad. Did a pretty decent job there picking up stuff. Oh, there's a hoodie. Okay, well, you know. We could just steal an item too. That's all pretty good. Pretty good. We could take a uh, square. Sure. Steal a garden. Why not? We don't really need to take any more gardens because I don't think any more actually fit. I'm um, just really looking in the shop now for. I kind of just want to get that improved tools to run ins, honestly, because I want to see what happens. Uh, it's looking like it's just not going to drop for us, though. All right. It's magic mirror or something. Metal detector. Not. Not exciting. Uh, Captain's hat's pretty decent. Uh, okay, take the fin, then take Captain's hat. Um, I realize I'm spending a lot of money reeling here, but I'm really we're just digging for improved tools. Uh, that's a thunder sword. Meh, whatever. Uh, I don't want to get reduced. Uh, the the uh, range damage because we do have an obliterator. We probably should have gotten better range because we <laughs> we're like minus 200 just because we've taken so many magic mirrors at this point. Like this character feels tagged for magic mirror somehow, which doesn't even make sense because we're 
and neither of these characters are from the diversified mod i don't even know what magic mirror would be tagged under as far as an item i think it's just it just happened to be showing up a lot and no improved tools going to wave 30 with the amount of rerolls i've done is also kind of absurd but whatever we'll see if we can get it we can get it if we can't we can't it's the way of the world gotta say it would be fun to you know pick it up right now and crash the game on wave 30 wouldn't mind ending the video like that not at all um okay take a penny these are all nothings doesn't matter doesn't matter you know what's funny is that i'm probably gonna see it and then just roll past it since we're digging really hard for it right now. Okay, we can lottery a few times. Uh, prohibition. If we take prohibition, we're more likely to see Im improved tools. <laughs> really, really trying right now. I'm going to spend all of our money on any rules. Um... Unbelievable. Right now. I guess we watch out for like any sort of reroll option. Oh, extra stomach. That's nice. Um. Nope. Nope. Still nothing. This is actually incredible. Spider would be pretty good, but it's not improved tools. You know, we just spent like 30,000 materials. Outrageous. Outrageous. All right, wave 30. I get it. I get it, game. You're just not. I don't even know. Maybe it's like. I don't want to say it's not in the item pool because it should be in the item pool, but like. I don't know. I don't think we're tagged for structures as part of it. We also have that one garden stuck in the shop. So, I mean, that's a whole other issue, obviously. If it shows up at the end of this wave, I'm going to be a little frustrated. Anyways, I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, don't forget to do that YouTube stuff. Like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz really helps out the channel. Uh, I hope you guys don't mind this like weird format I did here. If you did, definitely let me know. If you didn't, also please let me know because I typically don't like to do this, but um, I kind of just wanted to push this run and not take it to like 40 or 50 or anything. I just wanted to do it all in one video. Um, you can see the lag. All right, let's 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 hit this and just see what the shop gives us. It's not here. OK, well, whatever. All right. Well, again, hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you next time. Jeff out. Bye.